To our final number, it's time to give out uh, 10 awards. 10 awards, and the kids know who they are, and while they're coming down below there, I'm going to tell about them. We get um, service points, and when they make 120 service points, they get a P from the school. Well, the music students were getting so many service points, it was breaking the counseling's bank. So, Ms. Clisham, right before she left, she had some discretionary funds, and she said, she did a lot of things for a lot of departments, but for our department, she bought a whole bunch of P's that have a little music note on it, just because our musicians do so much. So we have our own service point P's, and many of our kids earned them, and they, I handed them out today. So I'd like all of you kids to um, come stand right here, just the way those beginning trumpets did. Can you do that, please? Thank you, Ryan. Thanks for following Ryan, because he's following instructions like a brave guy. <laughs> And I'd also like all of the kids that got the P's to stand up. Now, all of these kids that are standing earned their Presidio P. Yay, Presidio! In addition, and these kids, some of them got more than 120 points, I need to point that out. You kids can sit down now, thank you. They got 10 points per concert, so 120 points means they got how many concerts in three years? 12 concerts. Now, we had some kids that got so many more concerts that I'm also gonna give them a pin in the shape of their musical instrument. But since I haven't even ordered those pins yet, tonight, Tonight, they're going to walk over there, and they're going to get a flower. But they have to shake my hand and look in my eyes first. <laughs> so we're... I think it's because I'm by the speaker there. Uh, I, oh no, I think I can do it, don't worry. But thank you, thanks. Okay, so Julia Rafferty earned 210. Julia Rafferty earned 210 points and if Armin would come and give her a rose. Keiko Kuratani for 230 points. Twenty-three concerts. Ryan Leon played two with twenty-three concerts. Two hundred and thirty. And Nora Stacy. Twenty four concerts. Alexandria Lee played twenty four concerts in her time. Jessica 
end. 25 concerts. Martin Krauss, 260 points, 26 concerts. Amanda Callender has a beat by one, 27 concert. And before I say our grand winner here, I want to say thank you to all of you kids for your three years of service here at Presidio. Thank you, it's been a great three years. And we've got Mr. Music here who came in in the sixth grade and I had to put him in the jazz band. So that's how he got a head start on everybody. And Mr. William Talent had 300... Oh, what did I say? Who's he? <laughs> I think I'm awfully tired. William Geist, I'm sorry, William. William Geist, 32 concerts. All right, kids, if you'll go back and put your roses under your chairs. You see, we have a few more roses here. So, could you put the box? It's almost Mother's Day, and as we all know, we can't do this without the whole village. And I think. I need to tell you what it's like to be a teacher here at Presidio Middle School. First of all, we just had our teacher appreciation luncheon, which was so fantastic. I felt like it belonged in the parade magazine in the, news, in the Sunday newspaper. Uh, you really, it, it, you have no idea how much that means to us. Slogging through and all of a sudden you come up there and there's this wonderful lunch served to us with such grace. Thank you, parents. But that's not all. It's not just the lunch. It's the support that we get all the way through. Now I'm going to start speaking for myself. If I need somebody to drive at the last minute to SF Jazz, like I did last Monday, here come the parents. If I say, we're going to go on a trip ice skating, right at the very end of the school year, right before the holiday, when nobody has anything else to do, here come the parents schlepping the instruments and standing in the cold watching their kids play music together. Then schlepping the instruments back. I'll say, gee, we sure would like to have a party. Could you bring some really good food? Boy, oh boy, that food is good. In fact, my coaches that come from the conservatory, they all want to come on party days. <laughs> so I send all the leftovers home with them. You know how 20-year-olds are. Um, we do picnics, and by the way, we're going to be having our end of the year picnics. Um, so sixth and seventh grade parents watch for that. That's going to be one of the last four days of school. Um, I, I, sometimes I get so frantic, I don't even know what I'm doing next. I, try, I have a tendency to bite off more than I can chew. And out of the woodworks, out of nowhere, comes some mom or some dad saying, can I make phone calls for you to find that restaurant, such as what Alex's mom just did? Or can I help you with a towel wringer? I remember that one that came out of nowhere. Or can I help you, all of a sudden the mom is there helping me cut cake when we're having a party. You all really understand. Thank you for that, parents. So I know... Right, I've, I've talked with so many of you, and I, this is, I stopped doing this, but I had to do it again, because this has been a very, very, very active class. There's gonna be somebody here I'm gonna have forgotten, and if that happens to you, please come take a flower, but more than that, come and tell me, so I can thank you personally. So we're gonna start, and we're gonna have